Hello, this is Random Pal, and we're reviewing Batman Return of the Joker for Game Boy. Now, as you can see, you can choose the difficulty, and that's pretty much about it. And since it's Game Boy, of course, there are kind of delays in the shit that happens. Now, we start this game. Unlike a lot of games, you can pick your stage. There are only three stages in this game. But, just because it's a review, we're going to choose the first stage. And for Game Boy, for Game Boy, the graphics are fairly decent. And the music, although annoying, is not bad for the music. But we're gonna pick stage one just because why the fuck not? Stage one of course is the sewers. Well, there was a fuck up in the program, but anyway, this is stage one. As I said, the music is just pretty good and you notice you notice the animations aren't really bad at all with the Batman flailing his cape and shit as he turns. And just like the NES game, you have the wall jump, which you can use just like the NES version. But you also have the grappling hook, which uh, can be called upon. If you jump in the air and press the up button, you'll use the grappling hook. And to release the grappling hook, you hit the jump button to release it. That's a new feature, the grappling hook. Uh, and also, like that bat symbol I just picked up, you can pick up fucking different weapon upgrades that could be useful. Then you get to this one part where the water starts rising. Now this part is a pain in the ass because it's really hard to get through it without fucking dying. Especially when you have to go through these parts like that. I'm already getting my ass kicked because I demonstrated that too late. One second. Sorry about that dog interference. I'll get her fear because that I apologize. Ah! Ah! Yeah, that's the part where if you get fucking knocked into the water, you're fucked. But anyway, like I said, good game, good, and there's multiple continues. But every time you continue, you start back at the beginning of the stage. So if we die this time, if we die this time, we'll pick another stage just to show you a little bit of variety. But it's overall an interesting game. It's a fun game for Game Boy. Fucking up right there. But overall, overall it's a good game for Game Boy. It's definitely worth the fucking play of it. Not an easy game because of the bullshit. Ah! Yeah, the jumping around can screw you. pick a different stage just to show you something different than the sewer because there are multiple stages in this game even though not many let's pick stage two this time so you can at least see some different atmosphere fuck the joker and of course if you beat all the stages you go to the final stage but the rate we're going we ain't gonna make it that far <coughs> Anyway, then the second stage, the machine shop. 